welcome back to the Rum Brothers. We've got another spirit to taste and review. It's a rum. For you. It is a rum. We are the Rum Brothers, therefore we are doing a rum. It's a rum bum dum. All right, which, 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 <laughs> All right, which one shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to tell us what we got? All right, shut up. All right, <laughs> so Captain Morgan, we all know the captain, but do you really know the, the captain? The captain, the real captain, he was a Welsh privateer. So it is based off a real pirate of the Caribbean. He didn't get his own movie, but he got his own rum. How do you think of that? So this is the Captain Morgan Private Stock. This is a spiced rum. It's a blend of Caribbean rums. It is dark, so it's aged a little bit. Probably not too much. Yeah, so there's no true source. We can't like say that. We can't say like Puerto Rico or you know wherever. It's just all over blend. Kind right. Of thing. And this was recommended. So please, if you have spirits to recommend, please put it in the comments. We do read them, even if it takes us two years to review them. <laughs> Yeah, strangely, this has nutrition facts on the back. I've never seen that before. That's a new thing with some some laws that I won't go too much in depth in case it gets political. This is 107 yes. calories. Oh, no. For a fat. Serving oh, size and one, and a half. one and a half ounces. All right, well, let's smell it. Smells spicy. Smells like a spiced rum. Right, Ooh, so what this, is that? this is a spiced rum. I don't know if I mentioned that. Vanilla. Definitely vanilla. It smacks you in the face with vanilla. What does the bottle yeah. say? There's something else there. Hold on. It's like a vanilla ice it does, cream. Yeah, it smells like vanilla ice cream. That's right. Yeah, it's like creamy vanilla. All right. All right, let's try it out. That's a little... That's vanilla ice cream. Yeah, it does. It tastes like vanilla ice cream. It's got a very oily mouthfeel, too. Mix this. Mix this mm, thing. Yeah, the finish is vanilla ice cream. <laughs> is that literally what they say? No, no. <laughs> you, you looked at the label and then said it astounded, like that's what it said. So I was like, <laughs> Whoa, vanilla ice cream. So I don't know if I like this. I mean, it tastes good. I don't know what you would use it in. You could use it in a Coke. <laughs> yeah, you can put it in Coke. Get vanilla Coke, vanilla rum and Coke. You know, yeah. it's funny because that's like the, uh, that's <laughs> when you can, like not doing anything else with the rum, that's when you put it in a Coke, which is kind of like, when you hear us say that, you know, something might be wrong. Or dump it in the trash. Definitely a mixer. I mean, if you, if you got the sweet tooth and can stand it, yeah, drink this straight, but we'll all look at you at a sideways glance and yeah. be like, hmm. On a hot day, like put it over ice maybe. Not a cigar rum, not a sipping rum. Uh, the bottle looks cool though. If you want to go get a Captain Morgan rum, get this. I would say you could treat this like a white rum. You could squeeze a lime and a lime wedge in there and that might make it more tolerable straight. Kind of cut that asa creamy. Um, but yeah, this is this is definitely a mixer. If you are someone who likes the effects of rum, but not the rum itself. Yeah. Sure. This reminds me of bamboo a little bit. See our review of bamboo. Better than bamboo. I oh, would yeah. Say. Totally. Totally. I, I like this better than bamboo. Too. Is bamboo spiced? Bamboo, yeah, it's a spiced rum that has more of a banana flavor. More of a magic like a, marker flavor. <laughs> like a synthetic banana flavor. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah this is the super interesting. It tastes there. like briar's ice cream in rum so the taste is not bad but you know it's if you drank more than one glass of this you probably would throw up yeah is this diplomatico is this el dorado 12 year no how much do you guys think it cost 24 18 no <laughs> i paid 28 bucks so you typically see this <laughs> between 25 and 30 dollars wow don't spend that much captain morgan you have disappointed the rum brothers so overall, sounds like we think it's it's all right for what it is. If you like a sweet spiced rum for mixing, it does the job. But if you are a rum fan, th this might not really be your thing. Yeah. I think that's what we're saying. But it fits a unique flavor profile. So yes, if you were trying to make a collection... This would have a place on its own, I think. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Bye. If you have any other <laughs> suggestions for us to taste or review, put it in the comments below. Like this video and all that. We'll be back soon with another review. Join us, won't you?